In today's video, I'm going to show you how to install Facebook Pixel and enable conversion API uh, on Shopify. So let's get started. The things that we need to do uh, before connecting our Facebook Pixel is to create a Facebook business page, create a business manager, then create a Facebook ad account, and then create a Facebook Pixel. So let's get started. Uh, the first step is to create Facebook page. Uh, so you need to log in into your Facebook account and then uh, find pages. Here you can click uh, create a new page. You need to name it, choose category and also provide some kind of description, but I will skip this step and click create page. Then we need to navigate to business.facebook.com and uh, choose uh, login or create an account to create a Facebook business manager account. I will choose from existing accounts. So inside my Facebook business manager, I, I click on ads manager. Here I can add new ad account and go to business settings, select ad, create a new ad account. Here I add a name. Uh, choose time zone and my currency and, and click next. Here I choose uh, add account, how it will be used. I choose my business and click create. I need to enable this toggle to manage that account and click assign. Then I need to add my payment info, but I skip the step for the demo purpose. Uh, then I need to create a new Facebook pixel. Uh, that's why I go to data sources pixels. Click add and here I name my new pixel, paste my domain as well and click continue. Then I choose set up the pixel now, uh, select that code using partner integration. Here I need to select Shopify and now I go inside my Shopify admin, go to preferences, scroll down a little bit, choose Facebook pixel and click set up Facebook. Uh, I will need to click add app, choose my account, add Facebook as my sales channel and click uh, start setup. I need to connect my Facebook ads account to get started. Under business assets uh, tab, I need to find my page that I gonna connect and click connect. Uh, then I need to manage Facebook and Instagram data sharing preferences and here uh, it is important to select maximum. This will track customer activity data uh, using Facebook Pixel advanced matching as well as uh, conversion API. That's why we select maximum and click save. I need to select my uh, Facebook Pixel that I gonna use for uh, this account. Make sure to uh, select the right one that we created earlier. So I select my demo Facebook Shopify Pixel. And also I uh, agree with terms and conditions and click submit for review. Uh, now it's all set. I click done. Now I jump back to Facebook, click on the checkbox that I've completed the setup uh, on Shopify, click next. I can enter my domain to send the test traffic and check if pixels working. It may take some time. Yeah, you see that it is active. Then I click next and uh, finish. Uh, then what we need to do is to click uh, add people. Make sure to select your Facebook account and uh, provide full control to access your newly created pixel and click assign. Then go to connected assets, click add assets and uh, select your ads manager and click add, then done. Uh, then what we need to do is to verify our domain. So we go to brand safety, domains. So I click add, choose create a new domain, paste my link, uh, click add. Uh, then I copy this meta tag, go to my Shopify admin, uh, go to online store theme, uh, press three dots, choose edit code and then under head section I paste domain verification from Facebook and click save. Then I jump back into Facebook and click verify domain. It may take up to 72 hours uh, to Facebook find your meta tag so you will need to wait. After you verified your domain then click on these three lines and choose events manager. 
uh, here I need to click manage prioritized events here your domain should be verified and when you click on it you can click on manage events I will show you on the screenshot below how to set up it it will be four events content view add to cart uh, checkout initiated and purchase set up the way you show on screenshot below and the last thing that we need to do uh, is click again on events manager uh, click on my demo Shopify pixel here and then click test events here add your store URL and click uh, open website make sure to click on your pages click on your products then make sure to add it to cart and make it test purchase to verify that um, Facebook see all your activity as you see we have two page views content view add to cart and you will see that it's tracking value currency uh, you will see that your pixel is working I hope this video was useful make sure to subscribe to my youtube channel not to miss new videos about commerce analytics and if you want to level up your tracking then check my e-commerce data infrastructure guide